I'm Terry. And I'm Angel. And we are back to you today. We got an unbelievable show. More homemade dressings. Yay. What a treat. Uh, the last time we did this video, we got such an overwhelming response. Mm -hmm. And people were just, I mean, the comments were unbelievable in terms of dressing. And, you know, dressings are something that just really takes your whether it's a salad or a dish over the mm -hmm. top. It's yeah. like the perfect com condiment, yeah. right, babe? I completely agree. <laughs> yep, absolutely. So like Terry said, we've had a lot of comments on our last dressing video. A lot of great feedback. Thank you so much. Uh, people writing in saying they t tried the dressings and how much they liked them and, and just wanting more. So uh, before, we are... Oh, please. Before we get started. So what? yesterday... We ran a 5K, oh. our first 5K, and I am so proud. Aww. I mean, unless yeah, I, I just had to give Aww. praise mm -hmm. to my baby. She ran the 5K. Aww. She ran the whole way. Um, first time ever. Clint Strong. <laughs> and we've been training for months, <laughs> as we've been telling you guys on the mm. show. So our next race will be a 10K, um, probably in May. We have to schedule that, but... I'm just so proud of my baby, and Aww. we posted pictures Aww. on our uh, Facebook and so other social media. So I'll post mm -hmm. it at the end of this video. But I just, I just couldn't, Aww. couldn't start this video chill. without you, Stop it. you know, giving, I'm <laughs> <laughs> without giving you praise, honey. Aww, so thank you. Unbelievable. Yes. I'm unbelievable. So yeah, proud of her. It's not. It's definitely outside my comfort zone. Not outside of Terry's comfort zone. <laughs> Avid runner, awesome runner. But has been so patient with me he did not leave my side it was like <laughs> two peas in a pod running and it was awesome i feel good i thought i'd have some back pain or leg pain but feeling good so yeah um what an accomplishment so thank you honey <laughs> You're welcome, babe. you can do anything you put your mind to absolutely anything sky is the limit absolutely. so go for it get inspiration and just go for it exactly so, so, thank you. All right, babe, now well, we can get started. Because of you, we are making two amazing dressings that we <laughs> hope you will love. Uh, this is the ingredients for the one dressing, and this is the ingredients for the other. So, we'll okay. make this one first. We're going to make them all in our bullet, so it's real simple, real fast. Mm -hmm. And we are going to start with one that I am calling... Oh, and the reason why I look at my phone is because I type the recipes that I come up with in my notes in my phone so that I don't ever lose them and I can send them and we can post them on YouTube and everything is electronic. So a lot of people ask, you know, Angel, where do you get your inspiration or what are you looking at your phone for or what have you? And just because I type, I happen to type my recipes in here and I can't remember everything. So I just want to <laughs> make sure that I'm telling you exactly what I'm putting into them. So that's why I'm looking at my phone. Absolutely. So there available in our description box on YouTube, as well as we, we finally got our website back up and running. So yeah. I'll be uploading all the raw videos um, up to our website uh, this week and probably into next with all the videos I have to upload. And then they'll be printable there as well. So I'm yeah. excited about yeah, that. Yeah, me I'm too. Excited. We're so happy we got our website fixed. <laughs> we had a little glitch there, but um, okay. So let's start with this vanilla okay. Fig Dijon oh, dressing. Gosh, Yum! That is so delicious. Okay, Sounds so we're so gonna delicious. start with four. Um, you could use any size cup, honey. We okay. we don't have two small cups. You don't need a cup this size to make <laughs> it, but we just want to make so four uh, dried figs. Just put them in there. And these are original. These are original. We so this, mm -hmm. is, this is the first time we're trying these. I'm excited. So this is like uh, you know Yum. testing on the go, right? Yep, that's right. <laughs> One tablespoon of raw apple cider vinegar, honey. Okay. I have it right there. All right. Half of a vanilla bean, and I'm just gonna scrape the little vanilla beans out of here and put them in here. And then mm -hmm. Terry's gonna add the rest of the stuff. Mm -hmm. One lemon juice, okay. if you want to, honey. One so we can juice. just work together. Mm -hmm. So for this, and I'm sure. Everybody here has done a, you know, you just cut the, uh, whoops, the, well, we don't want vanilla people in this dressing. <laughs> we want vanilla in this dressing. So you cut the vanilla bean splash in zone. half, splash zone, and then Oops. you just take a spoon or a knife and just scrape it out and you get all the beautiful, fresh, beans hmm. oh my gosh just delicious 
Smells delicious too. Yeah, wow. The, the vanilla beans are and you don't wanna you don't wanna wait like you wanna get every one that's why I'm trying to do it this way, honey, because right. I don't wanna lose any of those delicious beans. Right, smells delicious. Actually, yeah. Put it in this way. Okay. Awesome. Uh, all right. Splash zone. Right. Splash zone. First one splashed a pr pretty bit. Good bit. Got little vanillas all over. Okay. Okay. So then, thank you so much. You're welcome. I have lemon perfume on now. <laughs> <laughs> and then one tablespoon of Dijon mustard. Okay. That's our Dijon part. So, okay. and then one garlic clove. Just well, it came out. One okay. simple clove. Of, oh, good, it did. Yeah. One teaspoon of tamari, and I'm using that as my salt component. If you're not salt free, just add a pinch of salt or maybe, yeah. you know, a half a teaspoon or something like that. But we're mm -hmm. salt free. Mm -hmm. uh, we are going to use a quarter cup of water. A quarter cup of water. Okay, here we go. Yep. Two tablespoons of sesame seeds. Okay. Oh, and I wanted to say that these both of these dressings i made nut free they're always gluten free but mm -hmm. nut free gluten free vegan mm -hmm. uh you know they're nice. every so pepper to taste pepper to taste if my favorite yep if you don't like pepper don't use it and that's it that's it okay. i mean just as simple as that all right so we're gonna put this in our nutra bullet yep i, will I like that name this. nutra yes nutritional I'm, right Nutri-nutritional. <laughs> While Terry was washing out the, the lid to the bullet, I was like, what what did I do wrong? That looks <laughs> kind of thick. I, I said a quarter cup of water. I mean, three quarters of a cup of water. So <laughs> this is what you get. It's really nice. It's gorgeous. It's nice and dressing. Remember with these... Uh, fresh dressings that you make when you put them in the fridge, they get a little bit thicker. So you can just thin them out the next day or the day after that mm -hmm. with some water, or you can just take some spoonfuls and put it on your salad and mix it up. So either way, but it is three quarters of a cup of water. So and it smells delicious. It does smell delicious. So the next it. one we're moving on to is called, what did I call it? Sweet and sour citrus dressing. Mm. So I love, 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 love citrus and so does Terry. So what we're gonna start with is one lemon juiced and we'll okay. let Terry do that. And then we are going to juice one orange as well. Oranges are so good right now. Oh my yes, gosh. Yes, they are. Tis the they season for oranges. They are just incredible. It's kind of cool how various you know, fruits yes. have different seasons. And different times of year. Absolutely. And just when they Absolutely. are at their most vibrant. Although I, I think I've told you, I have gotten so many great watermelons mm -hmm. this winter. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know what's going on or if I'm just getting better at picking the watermelons. I wonder if, but that, I wonder if it's global too. I wonder if like if you're in another yeah, part of the, of the world. You know, are the are the fruits different from a seasonal perspective? Well, so they it's definitely. Probably something I have to definitely, look they up. are. Definitely, yeah. they are. Just depending on so if you're in Australia, the weather and the seasons yeah. and how it goes, especially you know in more tropical areas yeah. where it's always nice all yes. year round. You know, the tropical fruit is just mm -hmm. twenty four seven. You know. Yeah. So, um, but the oranges are well, just. That looks delicious. Look at that. You know, we are just, we are some fruit loving people. <laughs> so this is heaven to us. And this orange, I don't want to lose any of the juice. Oh my gosh. Gorgeous. Okay. We're messy, having fun juicing the orange. Okay. So the juice of one orange, the juice of one lemon, two dates, honey. Okay. A half of a cup of water. Let's hope that's right. <laughs> <laughs> two. Uh, tablespoons of hemp hearts. Okay, there you go. Okay, one tablespoon of raw apple cider vinegar. Okay, here you go. One clove of garlic. There you go. One uh, teaspoon of tamari, or if you're not salt free, you can you can use salt, but that's one teaspoon of tamari for the salt free version. Okay, and then two teaspoons of raw. Tahini. Mm. So I like to put the tahini in separate just because it kind of sticks and I don't want to lose any 
two teaspoons ish. <laughs> Everything's ish, okay? Yeah. Yeah. So, and I think I've told you before, this raw one is really, really delicious. We get it off of Amazon. It's called Pepperwood Organic, organic whole seed yeah, sesame tamari. That's a really Pepperwood. Good one. So we get this one. My mom got me buying this one. And it's just, just you know, like anything else. They're just not all created the same. Right. So not all tamaris are created right. the same. All right. So we're good to go. And we're going to bullet it up. Just it up. Yeah. Okay. All right. Here, Here we, we go. go. All righty. Okay. Wow. Consistency and this looks is great. The right consistency. Absolutely. So we are correct. Wow. Oh my goodness. Mm. Babe, I can't wait to taste. Mm. I can't oh wait to my taste gosh, these. that smells incredible. So we just have a couple of small salads mm -hmm. here. As you know, we like to put everything in our salads. There's lots of fruit and veggies in these. So we will try the um, the fig, vanilla fig Dijon. Okay. Those names even sound appetizer. I was they trying. Just, they're it's so hard inviting, when you're right? making a recipe and you're trying to come up with a dressing. Absolutely. That sounds so good. Absolutely. So and then inviting. sweet and sour citrus dressing. Okay. Let's try that one. Again, it just makes you want to just pour it on. It does. <laughs> and a fork for All you, right. honey. And a fork for me. All right. Let's see what you have. Let's see. Okay. Uh, all right. All right. Which one are you going to try first? So we're going to try the vanilla fig Dijon okay. first. All right. Because we made it first. All right. So we'll try it first. All I right. had a really big bite. Yum. Salud. Salud. Mmm. My only issue with this is that I didn't use more. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's so good. <laughs> it is so good. You know what? The mustard flavor mm -hmm. is not overpowering at all. There's a really nice balance. It is. It's right to mustard and all of the other yeah. you know, different of the ingredients. Yeah. Mustard dressings are like. Whoa, can be overpowering, right? Mustard, exactly. Mustard, you know? I cannot wait for you guys to try this. Mm. You have got to let us know. Mm, and you can delicious. put this in other stuff too. This isn't just for a mm. salad. Like I said, it's such a great compliment to mm -hmm. other dishes mm -hmm. outside of a salad. Mm -hmm. We moved away from mm -hmm. the balsamic vinegars after we went raw and high raw pretty quickly. And well, because you're making such unbelievable mm. homemade dressings. Not that you have to move away from Not the that balsamic. you have to move away, but I'm saying the reason why we moved away is yeah. because there's so many different uses for it. And it just tastes so good, and it's such a uh, uh, just such a good contrast. Um, wow, you could just dip really, fruit in that. Absolutely. Veggies. You could marinate with it. Absolutely. You know, yum. Okay. <laughs> so sweet and sour citrus dressing. Okay. Let's try this. I love citrus. Love the so. name. Love the name. Salud. Salud, honey. Salud. Mmm. 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 Oh man. Babe. These are so good. And with the fruit we have on our dressing, I mean on our salad. Oh. Look, I have a fresh cut orange right there. I think I have a mango here. No, mm. it's, oh, it's orange. Mango. Mmm. Mmm. These are so good. You know what? Spring is in the air. Wow. These are so refreshing. <laughs> Put a little soaked wow. quinoa on here. Wow, but you mm, killed it. Make you, a you meal out it, of it. You knocked it out the I'm box I'm really this excited one, about these oh dressings. <laughs> okay, this is the first time we tasted these. Unbelievable. Oh my Sorry, gosh. So. We are telling you, try them. <laughs> it's a simple, again, nut free, soy free, gluten free, everything. Everything, they're free of everything, allergens. You know, they're they're exactly. light. Unbelievable. They're refreshing. Enjoy <laughs> them. Write to us and let us know how you like them. Thank you so much for Absolutely. asking for more dressing so recipes. If you like We're this so video, excited. like it. the video. Um, this was amazing. It if was. you like us, subscribe, subscribe and, and give us a thumbs up. Absolutely. Please. Absolutely. And we will be back with um more recipes and, and, and dishes and dressings and everything. Everything that you can imagine. So I'm excited. All right. Thanks. Love you guys. Take care. Bye bye. Bye bye.